So in a hybrid work world, uh, especially as companies are creating opportunities for employees to return to work, whether it's, you know, three days a week, five days a week, two days a week, like, right, everybody has their own approach. We wanted to elevate the employee experience to foster a culture of growth. So like making their time in our spaces worth it versus just sitting on a computer on Zoom. And we wanted to create a space that was like career meets community. Um, kind of that next gen career water cooler. So in partnerships with facilities and senior leadership, we launched the first ever in real life career center in the history of the Walt Disney Company. Woo, woo. Um, <laughs> and then um, we, we really like, we've personalized our approach in each location where we've done like an open event and survey and Slack to be like, hey, what topics are you curious about? And then we like took all those themes, understanding where our business is growing. And then we created these like mini experiences. So like we have like, we have like in, in a career meets inclusion shelf where we have books from all the guest speakers we've had across our heritage events. Um, it even has like a purpose card deck that helps you kind of lean into purpose and help you be intentional about inclusion. Or we have a shelf of like a area of content around like getting connected and we have like tips on networking, like actionable things that they could do. We have a section called get inspired where I have um, Amazon Fire tablet connected to YouTube. You put on headphones, you press the hype button and it goes, no, 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 no. And you listen to one of our ESPN music shots of hype. It's something our music team did with our on-air talent being like, rah, rah, go dominate this day. Maybe you need a little pick-me-up, like, right? So there's, like, everything from that to, like, we have a VR headset where you go into our virtual career center and other VR apps like the MBA or our iPads with our career chatbot. So if I'm not physically there. We're not hosting an event. There's, like, a self-service career platform. And we even have a partnership with LinkedIn to do LinkedIn learning on one of the iPads so people can throw it up on the TV if they want to watch something together. And then we host like cool events like mindful coloring or for now our well-being week at work. I'm doing like a sound healing and it's like take a break and like chill and like listen to sound frequencies to help you like go do the next thing, right? We just had a busy sports season from football into March Madness starting NWSL it never stops here but like the summers are a little less intense um um so kind of helping people recharge we even have a section about like get inspired from our past to help inform our future so we have books from like our like previous leaders or like Pixar's brain trust approach so um it's it's a combination of card decks like design thinking toolkits books ipads and then we have a tv with like content that goes to our digital tools and apps and it's like people scan it and then they can access it um so it's a self-service space but it's more in the sense of like collaboration like a lot of people come and like leaders come and host team trivia um like sports trivia before they build a social media content calendar or um we'll do an event for a heritage month or we'll do a leadership meetup when we have leadership in town from the east coast and so it's kind of ser it serves this like community space and it's also physically like you're seeing career like as you walk through the space and it's next to the kitchen and the it desk so it's a highly trafficked area so it's like it's top of mind, I think, versus waiting till year end or that conversation with your leader. Like it makes it a bit more proactive in how you show up. 